left her husband and she says she want to help people. She want to do more for the community. She want to focus more herself. She want to achieve her goals and stuff. She want to be more than just a mother and a wife. That was the conversation, guys. She said she want to help people. She want to be a, a millionaire. She want to support the community and stuff like that. She left her husband. And this is what she, she said. She was going to help the community. Go find some money, somehow make money and stuff, be successful, focus on her kids and do well for herself. Every one of her content since she left that man, this is what she's talking about. Listen to this. It says, I what what that say? Look I'm at here. my dress, dude. Look at my dress. How I'm supposed to go into work like this. I just got in the back seat of our <laughs> like how I'm supposed to go into work like this? I left my jacket on the back of my seat. I don't even know. I don't even know. She got her back blown out in the back of her seat. I was asking me if I had a whole bag or like some extra clothes in my car. Yeah. She left her husband and she said she's going to focus on herself, get herself together, heal, find a new husband. You know, help up the community, become a millionaire, a billionaire. This is what she's making. All her content is the same thing. After she left her husband, all her content is one thing. This right here. Yes, I do. I got my whole bag right here, but the clothes ain't like the clothes ain't appropriate for work. See some little ass shorts and a shirt. This ain't appropriate for work. And then I got my toys in here, like all the toys that I'm going to use. I got this. I got some Pop Rocks. I got my rose in here. Like, I got a, I got a whole bag, but I just didn't have, it's not work attire, but now I know. Now I know. I got some oil. I got some, I, I think I got some soap in here. I was asking me if I had a hope. Stop keeping people on your. I was asking me if. Guys, I should have, I should have got more videos for y'all. You guys, it was endless videos of her saying that I'm about to go to my appointment. I'm about to get my back blown out. Every one of her content says she left her husband. It was her making content. Guys, it's a full page of just her talking about getting her back blown out by guys. Her full, I thought I had more clips for y'all guys. I guess not. But it, it was literally a full page of nonstop talking about she's getting her back blown out. She left her husband. She said she wanted to be more than just a mother and a wife. She feel like it was time to go and stop focusing on herself. Her whole entire page. I'm thinking maybe she's out here actually going to school, getting this nonsense degrees, or actually opening up a business. Her entire page is literally eggplant like literally just eggplants non-stop eggplants all she talk about is dick appointments that's all she talk about that's all she talk about guys a whole entire page now one thing about the kids now one thing about her future goals that she was saying i'm gonna find me a husband i'm gonna be happy i'm gonna figure it out i'm gonna go through the healing process she's documenting her whole face the whole tiktok page is a documentation after she left her husband. She posts videos for new and every dude that's blown her back out in the car, behind her job, at home, nonstop. And she's saying, This is what I want us to do for the rest of my life. Documenting it, guys. I wish I, I, I wish I had two more clips for you so I could see the, the, the longer videos. I was like, I was so confused. She cried for seven minutes straight, saying that I can't believe it's over. I can't believe I got divorced him because you know everything with the. I'm thinking, you know, but she's saying that she's gonna he the healing journey. This is a, a talking about tomorrow lunch break. Wear your dress so I can look at my dress, dude. Look at my dress. How I'm supposed? To she's saying she's going back to work after her backup. Look, look, read the caption. Read the title. Read the title. I sent this to the group chat because of my way back to work. Literally, the caption was that she just got her back blown out in the back seat. And all that white stuff on her shirt, y'all know what that is. 
she sent it to the group chat people she worked with that she got her back blown out in the back of her seat and the white stuff on her shirt is that man kids like it, it she said, I'm going through a healing journey. I'm trying to get my life together. I want to go, you know, be a better person. I just don't want to be a mother and a wife. That's not my goal in life, to be a mother and a wife. I want to be more than this. Endless content. Endless content, guys. Endless content. Endless content of her getting her back blown. Endless content. Like, it's ridiculous, guys. I wish. Hold on, guys. I'm going to do this one time for the one time. I'm going to go to her page. Just for y'all. I was asking me if I had a whole back. I don't know about. I've been thinking about this. Y'all really need to stop sleeping on men that got some. This is her talking really about guys with bellies that she slept with. Sleeping on men that got some belly on them. I didn't know. That's what I liked until I liked it. So I got it. Bay, I know you're the gym trying to lose weight. Y'all miss me? I miss y'all. Seems like it's been so long since I made a TikTok. Still getting fucked as usual. This morning, I got some dick and it was good. Sis got some dick this morning, actually like three hours ago. Real good. Except for the fact that as soon as he put it in, in front of back, he hitting it. Boom, boom, boom. He like, hold on. I'm finna nut. We just getting started. What do you mean you finna nut? The whole that nut until I'm about to nut. Both can nut together. What do you mean you finna nut and we just getting started? We kept going. If you nut quick, be sure you can keep going. If you want it done, you are out the door. If you nut once and you're done fucking, he probably nutted quick, but we kept going. Man, he keeps going and going and going. Blood ass. Sis need to get her nut too. You a one and done type of nigga. Get it together. I'll talk to y'all later. I ever been getting fucked and y'all just get to arguing. You are really arguing. She left her husband for this experiences, guys. Her whole page. She left her husband for these experiences. She said, I don't want to be just a mother and a wife. She have kids of age, like really like 10, 11. They all on TikTok. And they know that the mom divorced the husband. And all she ever posts is stuff like this. Her whole content is stuff like this. She has kids. And not attend they on TikTok. And all she posted this type of content. Well, I asked him about another bitch. You fucked another bitch, huh? <laughs> he was fucking a missionary, and I asked him if he fucked another bitch. So we was going back and forth while he pounding my shit out. I was like, so you fucked her, huh? He was like, no, I should have fucked her. <laughs> should have gave you a reason to act out. We are so toxic. It is crazy. Who else in a toxic relationship? Who else be arguing why they having sex? Like, who does that? It can't just be us. We good, though. I love you, babe. I've ever been getting fucked. <sighs> I, don't, I don't even know, guys. Like, I legit don't know. Like, I don't know. Like, it's sad, but it's life, though. It's life. They, they, they think we don't be understanding this stuff, but it's life. <laughs> Like it's real life with them, them crying about her husband. Um, oh, you know, this will happen. I want to get a divorce. But she she left that man to go have fun, guys. She left that man to go have fun. And most of you, I'm telling you, man, most of us we think our girl, you know, after she leaves, she's gonna try to figure herself out. No, she's not. No, she's not. Every time that girl left her, her father home or left the mom, uh, I, I need you to understand this. I'm, I always say my next last, my last two content, I told y'all they should never have left the father's home or the man home. And y'all be like, oh, she has to go have fun, travel with her friends, do stuff. Nine out of 10, nine out of 10, most of these women end up in another man home. When they leave their father home or their husband home, nine out of 10, they go find another man home. And we live in this liberated world where this get passed around consistently. Consistently. And you think there's no healing journey, guys. I promise you there's no therapy. There's no healing journey. It's just an endless trains of bodies. There's no healing journey. 
there's no healing journey because you always meet them and they say, I have trauma. And you got to wonder where that trauma come from. There is no healing journey. Oh, I'm healing through a trauma. What trauma? She getting passed around, guys. And she just happened to stand. Oh, she, you end up in my. Yep. And she's hoping for a chance because she said as soon as she left the husband, the first thing she said, I'm going to pray for a new husband. You just got divorced. Like the same day she got divorced, she's praying for a new husband. She's getting passed around. She's not even focused on trying to find a man. She's just smashing random dudes and documenting it. And they're documenting. They're talking to their girlfriends in group chat saying that, well, oh, this was fun. Girl, let's go out again. Let's do it again. Like, hey, it's amazing, guys. It's amazing. Like, the minute they leave your household as the husband or the fathers, just going on random train stops to different dudes' places, endless stops. And somehow she's going to end up at your stop one day. She's going to be like, I'm looking for a relationship. She was looking for a relationship 15 bodies ago. <laughs> 15 bodies ago, she was looking for a relationship. You ain't find none of that. And you want it for me? You crazy. Like, I'm subscribed. I was asking.